Christ our Lord invites all to the table, all who love him, who earnestly repent of their sin and seek to live in peace with one another. All are welcome at our table. In Jesus, you are loved by God and you are welcome. The Lord be with you. And also Lift up your hearts. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and good and a joyful thing, always and everywhere, to give thanks to you, Almighty God, creator of heaven and earth. You formed us in your image and breathed into us the breath of life. When we turned away and our love failed, your love remained steadfast. You delivered us from captivity, made covenant with us to be our sovereign God, and spoke to us through your prophets, who look for the day when justice shall roll down like the rivers and righteousness as an ever-flowing stream, when nations shall not lift up sword against nation, neither shall they learn war anymore. And so with your people on earth and all the company of heaven, we praise your name and join with their unending hymn. Holy are you and your son, Jesus Christ. Fullness of time to be a light to the nations. You scatter the proud and the imagination of their hearts. You have mercy on those who fear you from generation to generation. You put down the mighty from their thrones and exalt those of low degree. You fill the hungry with good things and the rich you send away. Your own son came among us as a servant to be Emmanuel, your presence with us. He humbled himself in obedience to your will and freely accepted death on a cross by the baptism of his suffering, death and resurrection. You gave birth to your church, delivered us from slavery to sin and death and made us with us a new covenant by water and the spirit. On the night in which he gave himself up for us, he took the bread, gave thanks to you, broke the bread, gave it to his disciples and said, take, eat. This is my body which is given for you. Do this in remembrance of me. And when the supper was over, he took the cup, gave thanks to you, gave it to his disciples and said, drink from this, all of you. This is my blood of the new covenant, poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this as often as you drink it in remembrance of me. And so in remembrance of these, your mighty acts in Jesus Christ, we offer ourselves in praise and thanksgiving as a holy and living sacrifice in union with Christ's offering for us as we proclaim the mystery of faith. Christ is risen. Christ is risen. 
your Holy Spirit on us gathered here and on these gifts of bread and wine make them be for us the body and blood of Christ that we may be for the world the body of Christ redeemed by his blood and by your spirit make us one with Christ one with each other and one in ministry to all the world until Christ comes in final victory and we feast at his heavenly banquet through your son, Jesus Christ, with the Holy Spirit in your holy church, all glory and honor is yours, almighty Father, now and forever. I would like to ask all of those who are assisting and serving to come at this time.
we do have free elements for you Cheryl has that if you prefer not to, not to do intention we have a basket with cups uh, the Taylor hand is holding in her hand but the table is set come come to the table all of you
Please pray with me. Eternal God, we give you thanks for this holy ministry in which we have given yourself to us. Grant that we may go into the world in the strength of your spirit to give ourselves for others. In the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen.